Hello everyone and welcome to BISP Solutions. I am C.S. Sanjana Mishra working as the lead functional consultant at BISP Solutions. I specialize in synthesizing and analyzing the financial data. I have seven years of experience in NetSuite, HFM, FCCS. BISP Solutions is a tech company providing technological solutions across the globe. We have a far flung proficiency in end to end implementation and support. Today we'll be looking at voiding a check into the Oracle NetSuite application. So voiding a check into the application or voiding a check actually applies in a way that a check has been created. Let's say you had uh, created a check to pay certain expenses to an employee or a commission that needs to be paid paid to a partner or a vendor or anything a check has been created now you would like to void it so how you can do that into the oracle netsuite application this is what we will be looking at in this session moving on to our oracle netsuite uh, application So this is the Oracle NetSuite application. Now in order to void a check, uh, we'll go to the check, uh, the list of the checks that are there. So any of the check that is created, we can void it. Uh, so let's say this is the check which I would like to uh, void. I mean, I would like to uh, reverse the whole entry for this. So here when I click on the void button, a voiding journal entry will be passed into the books and the payment or the check that is this check that is check number 60 will be uh, voided. So uh, this is a customer journal entry form uh, and this is the standard journal entry form. Uh, you can of course customize the form depending on your organization's choices and the information that you would like to put into the uh, voiding journal entry. Uh, if uh, you are an employee, so of course it will be pending pro approval, but here I am in the, uh, I, I've signed in as an administrator, so I have the option to approve this particular journal entry. All the information it has been automatically picked up from the check that we have actually uh, void, uh, that we will be voiding, the entry that was passed, that is the check that was passed. Uh, the information is picked up from there. And as you can see, a voiding journal entry has been passed for this particular uh, check and the check number is 60. So this particular check, uh, checks voiding entry has been passed. And uh, once I've checked all the information that is there, I am going to save it. So the journal entry has been saved. Moving on to the list of the uh, checks that we had just seen. So this was the check that we had uh, uh, for which avoiding entry ha we had passed. Now, as you can see, the status of the check now uh, is visible to us is actually uh, voided. So this is how you can actually void a check that has been created and you can void a check into the NetSuite application. So this was all from my side. In case of any questions, queries, doubts or information, you can of course get back to us at www.bispsolutions.com. Thank you so much.